I want to clarify some things because uh, it's been a while um, since I was in VR even. Like I think it was like about even two weeks because I was so busy. I mean busy with just life, work, uh, building this PC VR setup that uh, in the last video I showed you, which I upgraded even more than I showed in the video. I, in the video I kind of like uh, skimmed uh, through the technical parts and then I said that I will, will uh, upgrade it even further. It's just that it's not gonna be on the video, but I, I you know, with the decorations or like, you know, with the additional uh, shelf, which there, she is there. <laughs> it was way easier because I just went to Castorama, I just picked a plank, cut it, done, great. <laughs> I should have done it with the keyboard shelf, but oh well, we, we did that. Um, I want to clarify why I was not, like, I think we were saying about six, six game overall. I did not try it out and I did not play. Um, we will try Pistol Whip today and because purely uh, I'm, it's not that I'm not excited about the game, but it's not, I guess, for me. Um, but I needed an excuse to, I guess, Give you an update what's going on uh, basically i did not want to try out this six game because for some reason i feel like we have an overwhelmingly like too just too much releases of boxing games and rhythm games and like i don't know for, for example Gnaga League, i'm not even sure why it's there true of the fire is one of the best games boxing games, but still not for me. Sync Riders uh, just released, Pistol Whip is another rhythm game, kinda. I mean, uh, we will see what's about it, because I'm, I know some basic stuff about, about this game, that you play just like as a kind of like John Wick style, you shoot people in rhythm, but you can, uh, can play it outside of the rhythm, so we'll see what's up with that. For some reason, I was just underwhelmed, you know, with all the releases that were happening uh, last weeks. And I guess it was fine for me because I was busy with building the setup uh, for the PC VR. The, com the p computer I actually ordered a few days ago, so it will be coming uh, like the next week after. Because today is Sunday when I record the deck, so the next week after the next week, <laughs> uh, I will have uh, the PC, I will do the video about it because I want to talk about my decisions in the customizing it and uh, what I wanted to have for the VR experience overall. Uh, I still need to mount the ceiling wheels because there will be a link cable uh, uh, like just down on my headset, but I think I will think about the cable later than the PC will come because I need to figure out because I've not properly used PC in like two years uh, because if you didn't know uh, everything I rec record edit put into the YouTube everything basically I do it through my phone so everything just comes through my phone and, uh, you know, it's a struggle without uh, computers, but when it, it will come uh, later in the next weeks, uh, I need to, I guess, relearn uh, again how to move around with the software, you know. So I think it's gonna take a few days also. Uh, VR is specific in a way that uh, it takes an extra effort to record and edit stuff. Uh, on the PC uh, because you know I'm used to my routine on phone I will see what's up on the PC so it, it will take a while so the cable will came, came will come later basically when I will figure out all the recording how it works on the PC uh, yeah so I just wanted to like explain myself why I did not play this because for some reason just wasn't excited about it overall over these seven uh, releases, six, let's see. Uh, so I was busy, and uh, actually, 
uh, we will be playing more after Pistol Whip because uh, the you know the future releases uh, here coming soon. Uh, basically, the last labyrinth will be coming. We uh, will be releasing at Wednesday. This week will be, and on the Thursday, the Cure Style of the Sun Pets. The two games I'm pretty excited to play will be releasing. So there will be monk more content uh, upcoming. Unfortunately, from my sources, I know Echo VR is actually delayed. Just like Aspire One is a meme, a VR meme <laughs> of the delays uh, to twenty twenty, unfortunately. But you know, I mean, whatever. That's just like that's just how it is. But the next week I will be recording this stuff, so uh, things will be coming up. Not worry. And after I will finish uh, like the uploads of Last Labyrinth and Curious Tales on the YouTube. I will upload the uh, the like PCVR tour setup and that I ha have here and will be using from this point all onward my plans overall like you know channel update overall like technical stuff and what you can expect in the future from me kinda so yeah, so that's it. Uh, I guess that's enough rambling for now. Um, I explain myself. I uh, I'm not dead. I just was busy and was preparing myself for the releasing the link release. PC is you know PC a new PC is always exciting, and it's especially exciting uh, when you are doing it yourself on and you know overall. It's just it was. Such a long time I used a proper PC, so I'm excited to get a new one and work with that and we'll see when it will take us with the channel, right? But we'll try Pistol Whip today. Um, <sighs> let's just try it. Fun fact, I my first game that I bought on Quest was uh, Beat Saber and my initial plan was to record a full campaign with no with no misses so basically all the beats of the beat saber all the tracks i wanted to record uh, uh, you know with no hit, uh, misses and it was like it, i think it recorded two thirds of it overall but then the later games come in and i can like get myself into the other games so Maybe one day I will release the whole compilation. So I have an experience with rhythm games overall. And I played this saber. I played back in the day also, which uh, if some people uh, know on the PC, is a click, uh, mouse clicking uh, rhythm game. Really intense. There's a really big community around it. So I was really into it uh, that. Uh, but we'll see how. Pistol will perform. Um, there is such a huge hype around this game, so it's gonna be interesting from my perspective because I don't really expect anything, <laughs> really anything. And uh, so we'll see what's gonna happen, kinda. So this is gonna be extremely uh, unbiased <laughs> because I wanted to have an excuse to talk about my, you know, activity <laughs> in the past week by playing this game, so maybe it will become um, a good uh, starting point. But let's go training, I don't care. It's always good to do the training. Should I enemy, okay. There's a bar, I guess it's a multiplayer. Alright, so you dodge the bullets and shoot the enemies. I guess that's the premise. Aim down to... To what? To reload? Losing armor. Ah, you reload with that, okay. That's the same mechanic I had in the Death uh, Horizon. With reloading. Okay, so I need to... I guess to dodge, I need to like move around. <laughs> Finally again, I'm good at... Good at you did it. Fuck, I <laughs> forgot the word. Punch. Okay. So that was a really fast tutorial. 
so basically a um, a like motion uh, kind of like game. Okay, it's gonna be interesting on this bed because I'm playing on the first mattress so that I set up without the boards, without planks, without anything. So that's my first time in half year that I feel with my feet my original setup. So we'll see with that. That's the different pistols. Okay. Is it some difference? It's just the smallest. Ah, oh, there's ammo. I guess. And I guess there's damage or whatever. I guess. Let's go with that one, with the biggest one. Uh, <laughs> customize. So you can pick colors. Christmas? I mean, I guess. No, that's Christmas. Arrows. Okay, interesting. Metal. Okay, well. This one is kinda cute, so. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Wait, hey, I wanted my. So it was that and that. Save and exit. Ah, uh, okay. I can. Can't customize, or is it bugged or something? Oh, I can switch hands when I, okay, when I shoot with the oh shit, with different arms. Okay, I don't know what the other one. I don't know why it's not working. <coughs> okay, select the scene. Um, Song title, artist tempo, song length. Ah, okay, so it's the scenes. I guess from the movies, I guess. True, usual ones, true, damage, effect, false, threat. I guess, you know, because the, the, the uh, Beat Saber has customization, mixed reality, with... Uh... Ah, okay, maybe it's a mixed reality setup when you record yourself, yeah, you know, from the different different angles, and then you can like show on the video. Interesting. Ah, what modifiers? Player, game settings. I wouldn't, I think, uh, set up anything for now. Let's just see how to go. Let's go for normal. Wait, how to do this? Fucking confusing about uh, changing stuff. I did not press anything, even though it did, did it change the setup. I know what's up with that. How? The fuck is happening? <laughs> I really don't get it. Okay, well, I guess we're playing on easy. Uh, okay, <laughs> weird, but maybe I'm I'm dumb, uh, but yeah, okay, whatever. Let's go with. Ah, okay. Maybe after. So maybe I can now. Let's go. No, still not. Whatever. Let's see. What's the so I guess it's the scenes or levels. That's kind of intense. <laughs> to do the beat uh, kind of gameplay. I guess let's try just shooting for now. Later we'll see 
if it's gonna be easy to play with rhythm or not. Jesus, this auto aim is kinda big. Like it's really easy to shoot. Shit, my ass up. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, damn it. <laughs> Get out! Come get some. Ooh. Let's see the rhythm. Okay. Let's go. I did not expect the intensity like that. <laughs> oh. Okay, let me see <laughs> with the <laughs> my cuffs. Okay. I guess I can try to play it with uh, rhythm, but it seems like it's more fun to just like shoot around. So let's see the other scene with shooting uh, around. I guess, and maybe I'll try to with room. Let's see the Lilith. Damn, I did not think that it's gonna be that, like that. How's the room? Holy shit! Ah. 
This level seems good. Let's try the rhythm, I don't know. But the auto aim is insanely accurate. I guess because of the intensity of the game. Ah, there's indicators where the enemies are. I don't realize that. <laughs> like, okay. Okay. I feel like I can't play with Revan for now. Felix, maybe with time I will try, but it's too intense to play as a version. Shit. Come on. Something. This is way more intense than any game that I've played on Quest so far. <laughs> I know that the Beat Saber could be like really um, exhausting, but this is something else. So I'm appreciating that. Okay, 
Let's play the last stage for today. And uh, should I try hard? No, I don't think so. Let's play the last on normal. What? Which one seems fun? I don't know. Let's go with the replicants. It's really slow. Ah, because there's a tempo, there's a beat rate, like everything is okay. Really specific, but it's like it's easy to get into this game, but not easy to like discover the real mechanics. Maybe in some time I'll try to play it on like like a really rhythm game, but for now I just need to stick with it. That's good that I play on my bed because we ha I have a soft cushion to, like you know, sit in uh, in case when I I really like dodge the bullets on the ground. <laughs> so I guess I'm lucky in that sense because on the ground it would be a little bit harder, <laughs> I think. So I kind of have a freedom of dodging, kinda. Let's try the room. Shit. Shit. No, fuck off. I need to get back the life, then I'll try to do it Now rip. I can Okay. I guess it kinda works. It's way harder with rim. It can be done. Whoa! Whoa! Okay, fuck out that. Yeah. Can be done firm. It's like I can already see there. There could be two, two communities around this game of spamming, really reflex kind of shooting style, and actually playing the rhythm game, like you know. <laughs> Let's go to the menu. <laughs> oh fuck. That was something else. You know, I really had no expectations around this game, but damn, that's actually really exhausting. Kudos to the, to the developers that they created a rhythm game that is insanely um, it's fun to play, it's exhausting, and there is potential because, you know, there is kind of like, you know, the thing about the skill floor and skill, um, wait, how, skill cap and skill floor, so it's basically that uh, um, if the game has a high um, skill floor, it means that the game is hard to learn overall with the mechanics and stuff like that. Uh, skill cap me it means like the potential of the game, like you know because you can learn the game, but then you know the mechanics and then you go next level to learn 
more and more about the game. So in certain games, especially in online, uh, it's the thing that if the game has um, a low skill cap, it means that the game is really easy uh, to learn 100% and master. Uh, these games usually are not like... Usually these games are really popular, but not like the longevity of them is not like long. So if the game has high skill cap, then it takes more time to learn the mechanics, more time to really master the game and like, you know, develop some sort of uh, dynamic between the player and the game. This game seems easy to uh, like, you know, get into it because it's just shooting stuff around you, just like re real reflex style. But then if you uh, on top of it put uh, rhythm as a calculation of damage and, uh, you know, uh, multipliers, the game becomes deeper than it is on the surface. Is that, uh, does it make sense? Something like that. So it's really easy to get into it, but I can see there could be some potential with mastering all the techniques, you know. I just can like play around uh, with that just as uh, first impressions. There, uh, there is a potential with that and maybe I'll actually play more. I, I, I really expected nothing with that and I was really not hyped like about, about it at all. I could not understand why people were so excited to play it, so, but it delivers. The gameplay is so intense that you need to get into it because it's just like it throws you suddenly to the gameplay. So yeah, definitely worth checking it out. Hell of an exercise, I can already tell. And fun to play, and I'm looking forward to what the developers will uh, be doing with the updates, uh, with the, you know, stuff like that, because, you know, Beat Saber, everyone's providers, uh, new mu music packs, new, like, you know, uh, customization, stuff like that, so I'm assuming they need to take the this path of, uh, like, updating this game constantly, because currently it's so popular, it's really like comparing to if we're talking about popularity, let's see that on the Star Wars, really popular like top charts or whatever. <sighs> Shit. So really like pistol with Beat Saber, Vader, Super Hot. Uh, Beat Saber, Vader, and Super Hot usually were on the top all the time because it's the most popular, you know, games. You can already tell by the reviews, but like. Pistol Whip kind of like released maybe like two days ago so far, but already has 700 reviews, so really interesting uh, how it will go. Uh, yeah, well, <laughs> I will play it more, we'll see how it goes, but you know, next week, another recess, I'm slowly getting back into the dynamic of the uploading uh, uh, peop uh, people, <laughs> videos. Uh, but I need to chill. <laughs> so I, next time we'll see each other uh, if the last labyrinth will be racing or the curious tales. Let's see what will be first. I think last labyrinth because I think the release is the day before. So <sighs> yeah. <laughs>